What's up guys, this is iTweaks here. And today I'm gonna to be showing you how to jailbreak iOS 7 on Windows. Now I know it's been a while since Evasion has come out, but I actually haven't done a video on how to jailbreak on Windows. And I wanted to go ahead and do that, and I haven't jailbroken my iPad 3 just yet, so I wanted to give it a shot. So this is actually pretty easy. I have used Windows to jailbreak before. So all you're gonna to wanna to do is go to evasion.com, and I'll put a link in the description below for you guys to just click on. And since we're on Windows, we're just gonna click on Windows, and then it's gonna bring you to a mega screen right here. Then you're just gonna to wanna to click download. Now, once you download this, I've already downloaded it, you want some type of program like WinRAR that's going to be able to extract the file. So if you don't have WinRAR, then I'll go ahead and put a link in the description below for that as well. So let's go ahead and minimize this because I've already downloaded it. And once you have WinRAR, it should automatically open up just like this. You're going to have your readme text and you're going to have evasion.exe. So all you want to do is double click on evasion and it's basically as simple as that. You just open up the program and you're going to click jailbreak. Now one thing I always recommend is go ahead and make a backup of your device before you actually try to jailbreak. Now just make sure that your device is plugged into your PC and click jailbreak. And then it's gonna start going through its process right here. If you've jailbroken before with Evasion 7, then you know exactly how this is gonna go, but I'm gonna go ahead and speed up through this, that way we don't have to sit through the entire thing. All right, so now that we're rebooted, it says on our screen to continue, please unlock the device and tap the new Evasion 7 icon. So just go ahead and unlock the device here. And there should be an Evasion 7 icon here, right there. So just tap that. Should open up, close, and then continue with its process. All right, so now we're rebooted here. You can see, let's go ahead and change that orientation. If we swipe to unlock, we should have Cydia on our device right there. So we're gonna go ahead and tap on that. Let's give it just a second to load. Okay, there it goes. Now it's gonna prepare the file system the very first time that you open this up. And this may take a while, so give it some time. All right, so now that we're rebooted, let's go ahead and swipe over here and let's go open up Cydia. So here, since it already prepared the file system, just tap user, tap done, and then once it loads, you're going to have Cydia. So a very painless process. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. Also, don't forget to like my Facebook page and follow me on Twitter for updates. And if you haven't checked out my gaming channel, go over there and stop by and say hey. Alright guys, until next time. Peace.